Yeah, if you don't mind, I'm just going to put on my thumbus and body armor because stuff is going to go down. <laughs> do, 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 I saw you, asshole. I'm coming. Liquid Snake! Did you like my sunglasses? You'd point a weapon at your own brother? You'd poison me, blow me up? Yourself as master? So I could manipulate you more easily. And you performed quite well, I must say. Although the boys at the Pentagon are probably saying the same thing. What the hell are you talking about? Following orders blindly with no questions asked, you've lost your warrior's pride. I asked so many questions, but they were never answered. Snake. What? Stopping the nuclear launch, rescuing the hostages, it was all just a diversion. A diversion? The Pentagon only needed for you to come into contact with us. The That's Fox what died. Killed the arms tech president and decoy octopus. You don't mean... That's right. You were sent here to kill us so they could retrieve Metal Gear undamaged, along with the bodies of the genome soldiers. From the beginning, the Pentagon was just using you as a vector to spread Fox Die. Fox Die? It can't be. Are you telling me Naomi was working with the Pentagon? They thought she was, but it seems that Dr. Naomi Hunter couldn't be controlled so easily. What? We've got a spy working in the Pentagon. He reported that Dr. Hunter altered Fox Dye's program just before the operation, but no one knows how or why. I wonder. Maybe they arrested her so they could find out the answer to that. No doubt. But I had no idea she was motivated by such petty revenge. We still don't know what changes she made to Fox Dye's program. That's funny. Oh well, it doesn't matter. I've already added the Fox Dye vaccine to my list of White House demands. There's a vaccine? There must be, but that woman is the only one who really knows. Fade out, fade in. Anyway, it might prove to be unnecessary. Why is that? You were successful in coming into contact with all of us, so we must have all been exposed to the virus. It's true that the Armstead President and Decoy Octopus were killed by Fox Dye. But Ocelot, myself, and you, the carrier, were apparently unaffected. A bug in the virus's programming? Hmm. Could be. In any case, if it doesn't kill you, then I'm Because I'm you shared the DM DNA After of Big all, Boss. Our genetic code is identical. So it's true. You and I are. Yes, twins. What was that but transition? We're not ordinary twins. We're twins linked by cursed genes. Les enfants terribles. <laughs> That's the way You're of saying fine. it. You got all the old man's dominant genes. I got the flawed recessive genes. Everything was done so that you would be the greatest of his children. The only reason I exist is so they could create you. I was the favorite, huh? That's right. I'm just the leftovers of what they used to make you. Can you understand what it's like to know that you're garbage since the day you were born? Must suck. But I'm the one father chose. So that's why you're so obsessed with Big Boss. Some warped kind of love. Love? It's hate! He always told me I was inferior, and now I'll have my revenge! That's weird. Then why do you choose you? Understand me, brother. You killed our father with your own hands. You stole my chance for revenge. Now I'll finish the work that father began. I will surpass him. I will destroy him. You'll become, You're you'll usurp like his him. memory. Well, I'm not like you. Unlike you, I'm proud of the destiny that is encoded into my very genes. Yeah. Yeah. What do I do? Cutscene action man. How do I stop it? 
Grenades, like last time. Well, time to make some calls, because I know Jack Diddle. Why it looked like a bird? Why'd they give it a dick? Yep. Sorry, gonna quickly call Otacon. Hey, how do I destroy this thing? You made it. So chaff grenades. It's completely self-enclosed and shut off from the outside environment. He's not using his naked eyes? That's right. So if you could somehow destroy the sensors, do you see that round plate on Rex's left arm? Yeah, that thing that looks like a shield. That's a radome. If you can destroy that thing, it won't be able to use its electronic equipment. So he'll be blinded. Yeah, try to hit that radome with a stinger missile. So that will stop it? No. Rex was designed so it can be controlled manually, too. Oh, great. <laughs> the part that looks like a beak is where the pilot seat is. In an emergency, it'll open up. Rex's armor is perfect. You can't destroy it. You told me that already. But the interior is a different story. I get it. First, I destroy the radome. That will force him to open up the pilot seat. Right. If you can shoot a stinger missile into the cockpit, you'll destroy the computer control. Plus, whoever's inside. You intentionally designed it with a weak point? It's not a weak point. I like to think of it as a character flaw. People just aren't complete without some type of character flaw, don't you think? I guess so. I, I mean, it is smart to leave a uh, weakness to something if you aren't 100% sure if you'll be able to keep control of it. Okay, put on body armor. Okay, carpet bomb, not nice. Okay, I'd like to be up and Adam, able to do stuff, please. Thank you. Oh, I think I already destroyed it. Ow. Okay, how am I supposed to avoid those? Okay, fuck off, game. Fuck off. Those missiles are far too much. Well, how? You can't see where they're fucking landing. Yeah, this is totally not bullshit because you see the boss is doing damage to you and therefore it's fair for the boss. This is bullshit! You can't dodge those! Yeah, I'm dead because they're magic. <laughs> okay, fuck you game. That's bullshit. There's no way of dodging those missiles right off the bat. And even after dying to it once, I don't fucking know what to do.
Yeah, it's basically an endurance round. Fuck off. Who can damage who faster? Where the fuck are my invincibility frames? Oh, and it just walks up and shoots you! But you can't run away because the missiles track you so perfectly! This is bullshit. Fuck you, Metal Gear. How are you supposed to dodge the fucking missiles, is my fucking question. Slice off its legs. Hurry! Get away! Great Fox, the name from long ago. It sounds better than Deep Throat. Oh! So it is you. You're a terrible snake. You haven't aged well. I'll send you back to hell! Yeah, destroy that thing that I shot with 10 million missiles and should have destroyed by now. Fox, why? What do you want from me? I am a prisoner of death. Only you can free me. Fox, stay out of this. What about Naomi? She's hell-bent on taking revenge for you. Naomi? You're the only one who can stop her. No, I can't. Why? Because I'm the one who killed her parents. I was young then, and couldn't bring myself to kill her too. I felt so bad that I decided to take her with me. I raised her like she was my own blood, to soothe my guilty conscience. Even now she thinks of me as her brother. But from the outside, we might have seemed like a happy brother and sister. But every time I looked at her, I saw her parents' eyes staring back at me. Tell her for me. Tell her that I was the one who did it. There you are! We're just about out of time. Here's a final present from Deep Throat. I'll stop it from moving! Fuck! Basically making the first part of the boss fight meaningless. Yay! Impressive! You are indeed worthy of the code name Fox, but now you're finished! Uh, no! Fire the stinger! Fox! Can you really shoot? You'll kill him too! Now, in front of you, I can finally it's die. It's no good. I can't do it. Zanzibar, I no. I can't do it. Neither Julie alive, good. nor I can't do it. An undying shadow. Good. I can't do it. Do it. I can't do it. Soon. Soon. It's no good. I can't do it. Do it, Snake. Not 
tools of the government or anyone else. Fighting was the only thing, the only thing I was good at. But at least I always fought for what I believed in. Snake, farewell. Get a freaking shot, man. Foolish man. He prayed for death, and it found him. You see, you can't protect anyone, not even yourself. Die! Lol. Yay, hey, more of this. No, please, no! Fuck! I hate this boss battle. I hate this boss battle. I hate this boss battle. How do you avoid the fucking missiles? They track you too perfectly. No matter what I do, they hit me. Oh. Oh. Fuck this. I'm looking up a guy. This is so shit. At least with white with the freaking sniper i knew what to fucking do i just sucked at it this is bullshit so apparently the chaff grenades were working i say bullshit the chaff grenades were not working wait for him go ahead and throw that there we go but still I could have sworn that they did nothing last time. Uh, yay! I select the stinger and it doesn't fucking come out. Mm hmm. But still, it's so annoying that it's just like, oh, you aren't using this one item that can run out? Well, then you're going to fail. This is stinking hard-ass inventory management. But still, it's so annoying. It's just like, there's no way to manually avoid the missiles. If you don't have a chaff grenade active, you're going to get hit, and that is just shit design. It's just like, you have to use everything at your control. Okay, no. Fuck you, game. Don't just change halfway through. Err, uh, but the thingy went off and it's no longer functional. Fuck off. If it's in fucking midair, don't... Like, see, you're gonna get hit. You're going to get hit so many times because the game's just like, ah, fuck you, ah, fuck you. <sighs> really wish. Fuck you, game. You're shit. You're shit right now. It's like, oh, he got too close, and now you're gonna get hit because the missiles aren't stunned. <laughs> <sighs> this is so annoying. Especially considering it's like, oh, I'm gonna run. But you can't. Oh, yeah, now that that ran out, it's gonna hit me again. Yay! Please activate. Basically, you have to spam a few of those grenades purely to maybe kill this guy. But still, I do not like this fight. I still don't like that fight. It's so annoying. And now, skip this long cutscene. No. Oh boy. Shoot anything else. Yay, I love not skipping this. I love not being able to skip this and it's going to be inevitable.
I have stun grenades, asshole. And they still hit me because, ah, uh, what's good game design, right? And they hit me. I hate this. This isn't fun because you have to go and just like, oh, I hope, I hope he doesn't hit me, but he's going to because the stun grenades aren't activated. This is shit. This is shit. Fuck off. And they blind you as well, and... Fuck this boss battle. Because then you have to look for that. Lock on, asshole. Lock on. Yay, I'm going to get hit again. Because the fucking thing is shit. This entire boss fight is shit. And now I'm going to die. Fucking kill me. I can't do this. I hate this boss fight. This is legitimately one of the worst boss fights I've played purely because it's like, oh, even if you know what to do, it doesn't work unless you do it in a specific way. So literally, you spawn in, throw out two chaff grenades. Oh, I forgot, it takes a while for it to activate because that's fun, waiting at the beginning of a boss fight. I just don't like boss battles that are so finicky and precise. It's like, oh, you have to do this, but even if you do it, it's not, it may not work because of one reason or another. It's just like, those kinds of boss battles are poorly designed, no excuses, zero. Also, God help you if you don't have any chaff grenades by this point. Now, in front of you, I can finally die. No, you can't. After that because far, here's this mandatory I section to do. From the Neither truly alive I'm pointing at him. All you have to do is shoot. He's gonna and die anyway. We all know this, but... Instead, it's just like, you have to watch him die in this long section before you can get back to the boss battle. Probably die. But this section, but this upcoming section is even worse. Because it takes a while for that to kick in. And then you have to aim. Yeah, please, knock me down. That's fun. Oh, and he's going to fuck. I don't like this. It gets you into a pattern. You throw the grenades, he sees you, he shoots the rockets, the things go off, and they hit you anyway because he fired them before he got stuck. Yeah, done. wait while it starts up because that's what all good boss battles need. But then we're gonna make the second one not have any startup because consistency, fairness, we don't need that in a fucking boss battle. don't like that he, that he knows where you are if you stand still. It's just like, oh, I'm sorry, changing the rules of your shit, and I'm gonna get hit anyway. Okay, just barely not. But Jesus Christ. Oh, yay, now I can't see. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> so much fun! Okay, that's it. Kill me now, because I want to start over. This is annoying. This is annoying. This is a shit boss battle. Fuck this, I'm looking up a guide again. How the fuck do you do this? Nothing's working. He shoots me anyway. No, where's the fuck? Fuck off. Go fuck yourself. I need that extra ration. Don't know where the ration is. That's it. Basically, you need to stay around him, I guess. 
But it's so obnoxious. Okay, so basically my new strategy is run right under him. Wait for him to start ro launching rockets. Run underneath. Okay. No. Why can't you stay stuck like you did last time? There we go. This honestly feels like a cheesy way to do this. Why does this... Why can't it be like, aha, this is how you do it, or even can't tell me. Where's the lock on? There it is. Don't you dare laser me, because this is the only way I can beat you. This, this feels like such a cheesy way to beat him. Why is this the basically official way of doing it? Yay, that's fun. Okay, wait for him to shoot rockets, run under him. Screw you. I am underneath you forever. How? That is against the laws of physics. Go screw yourself, Metal Gear. Just stay behind him and you'll be fine. Stay behind him and you'll be fine. But he runs so fast. His little stubby legs take him very far. Now this has turned into a complete joke. That is just poor design of a boss battle period. If you're able to turn a final boss into a joke, just by knowing what to do. Stop knocking me over. Okay, this is annoying again. You're... Quit it! It's supposed to have an arc! And now he's probably gonna laser me anyway. Stop it. This is the only way I can beat you. Stop taking it away from me. This is the only... No, no, no. Stop. Stop. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. This is the only, this is the only way I know how to beat you. So please, stay incompetent. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that seems fair. I'm going to walk a little bit forward, so... Hey, this is so fucking fair. Now he's gonna laser me. Yeah, fuck you. Get under him enough that he can't do anything. And I just have to make sure I stay out of his line of sight, even though he can go really far. Please don't laser me while I'm down. Or laser me while I'm down, but within my, uh... Ow. Okay, thank you. Thank you for being stupid. Yeah, I don't like it when a boss goes from being really, really hard because you don't know the only way to beat it. This is kind of like the tank all over again.
Lock on. Yeah, because the stupid thing wouldn't lock on. You were just walking back and forth. This is why it feels like a cheese move. Is this really how you're supposed to beat him? He just keeps walking back and forth when I'm aiming at him. Uh, I guess so. It's the only way I can get it to work. I don't like that boss battle purely because of that. I'll crush you into dust. No boss fight should go from being the most annoying thing in the world to being the most easy thing in the world like that. The only way to beat him, go underneath the legs. Because you'd think it's just like, oh, the laser, I'm not supposed to go there. So unless you are getting shot at by the missiles as you run towards him, you're screwed. You're not going to figure that out normally. But it's just like, and that's why I looked it up, because... This is one of those games where just like, okay, either I spend 10 minutes, like a long, long time trying to figure out exactly what I'm doing wrong, even though the w wrong way of doing it is still effective enough. It's just like, just how do I do this normally so I can get through this without too much pain and suffering? I tried, I tried, but when experimentation is that insufferable, it's just like, no, 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 